Hey everybody, it's Party Elite here cooking up some French cuisine with Grom de Ponch in Total War Warhammer 2. This is going to be a rough session, at least at the beginning, as two massive pseudo Bretonian armies are uh, potentially going to attack one of my armies over here. Rachnik Spiderclaw is in a touch of trouble. Um, which is, well, it's it's troubling. I do not think Thograk Necksnapper is close enough to reinforce. Uh, this is going to be an interesting start to the session. But beyond that, we have the Siege at Sudenburg as well, which uh, I think I'm going to have to sally forth without my cavalry over here. But Sudenburg, I mean, we've got walls. We've got we've got units to hold the, uh, the town with. I almost wonder if I should wait for Eldred Graf here to assault us, and that way we'll have the upper hand even more than we already do, because... I mean, his great swords would take the walls pretty quickly, actually. It's almost as if I would prefer an open field battle because um, if his, as soon as his great swords get on the walls, uh, they will they will melt whatever I put up there to hold the line, uh, and then we'll be in a lot of trouble. Whereas in an open field battle, I'll have time to um, well, there's no cavalry here, but I'll have time to use my you know what cavalry I do have here. Uh, and my trolls here as well to get some flanking going and things like that. So I might actually prefer an open field battle than uh, than one that uses my towers to uh, get some damage done. We might give them one turn, and if they don't attack over this turn, then we'll sally forth. Uh, because one set of towers, all right. Three sets of towers, not okay. So we'll 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 figure that out. We'll figure that out uh, before we get into all of that. And of course, the ending of the dark elves down over here. Uh, I do want to point out that we have done a little bit of renaming. We haven't done it all yet. I'll try and get it all done for next session. But we do have Flavor Town set up and good to go. And Orion's Canteen. These are names that have been given since like the second episode. And there are a bunch more names that I've got. I've got them all listed down. I just need to take the time to uh, to collect their backstories. Because what I did was basically as they came through, I wrote down the names so I'd be able to find them again and then collect the backstories. And uh, oh my, <laughs> there's uh, there's a lot of names. It's, it's going to be fun. But uh, but yeah, I got a couple in because I wanted to start making some progress there. So Flavortown and Orion's Canteen have been re... Uh, uh, I, I was going to say like rechristened, but re regorked? Remorked? I don't know. Remorked because that sounds like you've marked it. Anyway. I, I, I'm, I'm distracting. I'm procrastinating near uh, near certain death. Um, what can we do before we hit end turn? Because we do have a fair bit of money. Not going to upgrade Martech. That doesn't seem like the right call. Coal firm might be in trouble as well. We might have enough time. Uh, you know what? Well, let's... Sure. Let's have some faith. Like, we might lose one army over here. But it'll take them another turn or two to get to Coal firm, and And we, we should be able to intercept with Thograt over here. Um, because he does have lightning strike, so he'll not have any trouble taking care of both of those armies, so fine up there. Bel Aliad, let's go ahead and get you building up some walls. This is very much the front lines now. We are going to see a, uh, uh, rebellion there as well, which, I mean, maybe this army will help take care of. And what else have we got going on here? We've got Plaka, anything to build down here? I mean, sure, let's go ahead and get the, uh, where are you? Get these things going so we can get to the rogue idol over here as well. Still a little bit of money to go. Now, Wantle, anything over here? Well, actually, let's check over here. This is our, like, front line over here. Anywhere that needs, like, walls or anything? Oh. Well, that's problematic. That gives us, what, th two turns before Rebellion pops at Yotiqua. Uh, we have something of a garrison. But I don't want to distract from the war down over here. You know what? We can just stop extorting an income. It, it, we're making so much money. A little bit of, a little bit of not making money to prevent a rebellion is fine. Uh, once we get this upgrade done, maybe we should consider building something to help with obedience here. What is negative two from the buildings here? What? Nonetheless, corruption isn't the problem. It's so wild. Why is it so low? The whole difficulty level thing. Honestly, sometimes it's just like, what? It's fine. It's fine. We'll we'll build, uh, you know, the boss's tent or whatever. It'll be fine. All right, cool. Uh, enough rambling. Uh, money has been mostly spent. Come on, it's got to be something else that uh, jumps at us. 
This line is pretty well defended. Scrag hole needs a little bit of defending, but it's not ready for an upgrade yet. All right, you know what? I guess we are looking at Nahuantl here and might as well upgrade this. Sure. A uh, spot where we can replenish a bit faster. Why not? All right. Um, I'm not going to build anything else over here until I feel like uh, this area is a bit more secure. I'm not going to waste the money on this construction because if one of these armies swings down south... Then we're in trouble down here in two turns. Thankfully, I, can, I should be able to intercept that with the... Uh... Oh, man. You know what? I might need to sally forth sooner rather than later. All right. Let's sally forth. Let's do it. We need to free this army up so it can move up if necessary. And we still have... What was it? One more turn left to finish this recruitment? So, let's... Uh... Oh, man. That's scary. That is scary. Let's, uh, let's get to it, though. We have to do it. The battlefield we go. All right, folks. Got to make this count. Reinforcements are coming from behind us over here. Fair enough. So let's fall back to that point, right? We want to make sure that we're able to regroup before lines meet. Let's get y'all set up over here. Are we able to hit? Not right from the start, but shortly after. I mean, not that we want to spend too much time firing at Outriders with, uh, with rocks, but hopefully they'll clump up a little bit. We'll be able to get some shots in. Let's get you, my good friend, over to the side. No, well, let's get you guys back over here. Set you up properly. Let's get you guys grouped up as well. Push you over here. Because this will be more like the center um, once all the uh, reinforcements arrive. And let's get Oglock over here. Oh, man. All right. Let's begin. Reinforcements will form up over here. And then hopefully they'll take some time to get here. And we'll be able to uh, pummel them with rocks on their way over. All right, let's do it. Let's begin. I'm not going to lie, I'm a little worried. <laughs> I'm more than a little worried. That is a, that is a big army with, uh, with some serious fighting capabilities. With some serious fighting capabilities. Alright, let's go. Get you up over here, let's go. Are we able to lob rocks yet? I mean... Honestly, part of me does not want to hit those Outriders. This just kind of feels pointless. Yeah, see what I mean? Hold your fire. Save, save that ammo for uh, for the frontliners. Those outriders and all will eliminate in different ways. Get you guys grouped up. Make sure you're all set up properly. Lined up over here. And you over this way. Let's go. Alright. Fire over here. Let's go. Or actually, fire over there. Those are clumps. Clumps we can take on. Moving in over here. Archer's getting up over there. Let's get you guys to join the archers as well. There we go. Hurry up. You guys on this side. Let's go. Get you guys on that side. Let's get the trolls on this side. Cool. Artillery is firing away. Focus on the great swords, please. They are a very serious threat. Our archers are almost in position. Good stuff. Our cavalry moving through, moving through. Want to get them in there ASAP, right? They're just coming around the side over here. Wonder if we want to chase them a little bit. It's our biggins. Let's just keep them at bay, right? Let's just keep them at bay. Archers almost ready to fire. Probably not going to be able to fire anytime soon. These guys have the better range, right? So, we're going to have to accept that. Are we lobbing shots still? Come on. Yeah, and come a couple. Come a couple. Fire over there. Fire over there as well. Soften them up. And we go over here. Good stuff. Good stuff. It's gonna be a problem. Archers, fire over here. You three, fire over here. Let's go. General of the Empire. Gonna have to rush into him, aren't we? And come our shots. The cavalry up and around. Start to take care of some of their uh, range units, right? Are you ready as well? Both over here. Focus on. Uh, their leadership as soon as possible. Rocks are still coming through. Yep. Right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. We're closing the gap up there. Might want to get some counter charges ready. Might want to get some counter charges ready. Send you in there. Send you in there. Get you diving in. Fire up over there, please. Let's go. Pull you back. Charging through there. Counter charge over here. We're moving up there. Yes, good stuff. Charge in there. Send you around the back. Get some rear charges going. Get you guys firing off to the sides. Got to get some work done. In comes a side charge over here. I don't mind that too much. Let's pull one of you back. Alright, we're okay. 
We're okay, we're okay. Send you in over here. Doing all right. In comes a rear charge there. Let's keep pushing you over. All right, we're good. We're good. Closing the gaps up there. Yeah, excellent. Pulling you back over here. Those guys are suffering a fair bit, but that's okay. They're part of the garrison. Still launching rocks, eh? Yeah, we are. Um, we could try and turn around and fire over here instead. Don't know how worth it that is. You guys are starting to give up. All right, this is great. This is great. We've got this. This is a non-issue. More than a non-issue. I didn't even pop wah. <laughs> I was like waiting for desperate times. Call for desperate measures. Didn't happen. Want to make sure that we uh, eliminate them. Right again, because we, we want to make sure they're taken care of completely. I don't want them to come back. I don't need them to bother me anymore. So let's eliminate them as much as possible. Four boys are doing a good job. Let's get one of you chasing these great swords down. Shadows across the board, I'm thinking. We're taking a fair bit of hurt over here. The boys... They are just boys, right? <laughs> they are just boys. And you up there. Crush that unit just as much as we've crushed some of these others. There we go. I'm melting away over here. Um, stop chasing them. And get the trolls coming down over here. They focus on the great swords up there. Alright, cool. Well, let's go ahead and pick up the pace here. It's just a matter of cleanup at this point. Just a matter of cleanup at this point. Hopefully we're able to do some. Yeah, this is good. I don't know why I was so worried about this battle. I was like... I felt underprepared, I suppose. I'm gonna get down here. Finish these guys off. The, the only... Like, I'm not worried about this army. I just want to make sure it doesn't survive to harass me later on. Like, it's, it's a nothing army anymore. But, uh... If too many pieces survive, it'll just be annoying. Alright, good stuff. Let's end the battle there. Decisive victory. Yeah, I, I don't know why I was worried. <laughs> I think I wasn't worried as much as I was, like, indecisive about open field versus the siege battle. I think the open field was the right call. The work that our cavalry did was tremendous. I don't think in a siege battle it would have gone as well. Because you saw how quickly the, the great swords were melting our, our boys, right? So that would have been terrible for us. So I think that's definitely the right call. And 127 kills on these rock lobbers. That's uh, not bad. Not too shabby. 7% replenishment is not too shabby either. We don't need money. We don't need leadership. So let's go ahead with uh, with eating the captives. Good stuff. Unfortunately, they've survived, but uh, not the end of the world. Not the end of the world. Giant Blade for Oglock the Orable. That's pretty good, actually. Idle Carva for him as well. Love it. One turn. That's all we need. One turn. Don't you dare put us under siege again. Let me recruit these units. What do you got? You got nothing. You got nothing. These guys actually got away, but we kept them at bay is, I guess, what matters most. Um, you know what? We're able to recruit some more troops here. I just don't know if I want to. Part of me wants to save up for... I don't know. Um, the trolls were quite helpful there. I mean, I get chariots in one turn. That's not bad either. Some spiky rollers to join the uh, the cavalry charges. But no, but we, we, we want to go orc heavy outside of the, the crew that's manning the, uh, the, the, the rock lobber, right? So a part of me wants to wait for more cavalry options or something. Um, just add more boys for now. Here, let's do it. One, one more round, so it becomes a near full stack, and then we have you leveling up as well, so let's make sure we get, let's say, death from below. Sure. We'll probably get raider as well on top of that. And then down over here, what are we looking at? Have we moved yet? I'm trying to refresh my memory here. Smorbits has made his move up over here. We're just waiting for the storm to subside. We don't want to take any um, attrition damage on our way down for this like final engagement against the Dark Elves. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty good. We've started on a high note. Time to uh, bring that low note real... That, or rather, time to bring that high note real low, I think. Uh, this is troubling. This is troubling. I think, we'll, I think we'll manage. I think we'll manage. There's a lot of like peasants and stuff. The Bretonians. What could they do, right? What could they do? Here it comes. Wait. What? I guess I didn't take into account the obvious Bretonian option of being cowards, I suppose. <laughs> get out of the way. As the tribe gets bigger, your bosses move out of striking reach and start to get ideas. They begin to think they're better than you. They think they should get their own wall. Keep them sweet. War fervor or I'm the boss. Ah, keep him sweet. We got we got money for days. 
It's an economy-driven orc uh, faction, I guess. Obedience plus one with Oglock. Okay, cool. Martek over here. Let's go ahead and upgrade you. Feeling a little bit safer. Bel Aliad, let's go ahead and get you um, with a cave of shinies. This is unfortunate. I would much rather they engage me. Now I have to pull back and deal with them out in the open. All right, how far can we force march you? We can... Oh, man. All right, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to go ahead and force march you. Or can we... No, a regular march won't take us out to sea. Let's go ahead and take you out to sea over here. Let's go ahead and take you out to sea. Over here. Where is that other army? I want to make sure we block access to Kofor, obviously. Which is why I don't want to just uh, move as far as we can move. Where did that other army go? I suspect it's still also out here somewhere. Martek might be in trouble still. Oh man, this is... Oh, that's that's unfortunate. That move is very unfortunate because it keeps me on my toes rather than being able to move on. And over here, this is of course very unfortunate as well. But hey, not surprised. Let's go ahead and auto-resolve this one. Yeah, I didn't suspect we'd lose anything there. Go ahead and take the uh, replenishment as well. And we will redo our recruitment. Again, just one turn. Just one turn. All we need. Did I add anything globally? I did not, right? Yeah. Cool. So down over here, we've got some more bits ready to attack again. Um, what do we have? One each, right? Yeah, let's go ahead and take care of the Death Hag. Oh my god. Alright, let's, let's start the other way around. Are you easier to kill? Oh my god. So we have a 13% positive outcome there, or a 31%. Let's go with the 31%. Yeah, I'm not surprised there. Oh my god, that's going to be tough. We weren't... I should have checked. We weren't still exhausted. Oh, you know what? We may have been. We may have been. I might be uh, mixing up my turns. Uh, that's fine. That's fine. It's not the end of the world. It's not the end of the world. The storm has cleared up. wonder if we want to make our way over in that case. Can we make landfall over here? I don't think so. Can I take both of these armies on? That's the actual question. If they both attack me, a little worrying because they are uh, they are recruiting still. There'll be two full stacks against my one. Can you make landfall? No, you can't. That's fine. That's fine. We have to move small bits up a bit, I think. And then next turn we can strike. We'll take Malice out first, and then Ho Ha over here next. All right, cool. We'll be okay. We'll be okay. Some upgrades available, of course. We've got so much money. Uh, let's go ahead and get you going. Right. And let's go ahead and... All this is being built still. Still 3,400. Maybe we don't... Maybe we don't do anything. Maybe we just save up. Yotiqua. I mean, oh right, you know what? Over here we want to get the... Boss's tent. Start fixing our obedience issue. Because that is... Uh, quite unfortunate. Unassigned skill point. That's for Oglock the Orable. Let's go ahead and get you Raider. Sure. We just got to start raiding more. And we cannot move you this turn, obviously, because you're recruiting. But next turn, we can start making our move up to apply pressure to the Bretonians. I, I still can't believe they, of all things they could do, of all the things they could have done, they went up there. Now, surely they'll attack us now, right? They don't attack us, we should be able to strike them. Oh, Malice, what do you want? Peace? Are you serious? You want peace? That's hilarious. Not a chance, buddy. Not a chance. Right here they come. Yep, uh, I can retreat, or I can take this fight on. Singal. Oh, I guess this is the army that Ho Ha was in charge of has been swapped around a little bit. That's what it looks like. If I fall back, then I've, I'll find myself at square one. I think we have taken a little. Well, like we're not at full strength, but yeah, that's so many hydras. I think we'd be fine. Gotta be careful about these black guard, obviously. Couple characters here and there. I think as long as I'm careful, we should be okay. Our trolls and chariots can shut down the Cold One Dread Knights pretty easily. Worried a little bit about the uh, War Hydras and, and Carabdis and stuff. Not too much range. You know what? Sure. It's like right down the middle. I think we can take this on just fine. Just gotta be careful about not losing any units, not breaking my heart. To the battlefield we go. Let's 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 do this. 
All right, let's do this. Let's do this. Uh, not gonna gamble that, obviously. Start deployment. It's a good bit of, uh, winds of magic to start with. But let's see. How do we want to do this? Let's go ahead and get y'all. So again, they have artillery, is the uh, unfortunate side of things. Might want to Vanguard deploy some units to try and shut that down, as we've started kind of doing more often lately. There's our front line. Let's get our nasty skulkers. I can get them both posted up. Well, one up there, maybe in one up over here. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. Fair enough. I'll take it. Uh, so yeah, we can shut down their artillery, hopefully. We'll also get, of course, our... Um, get my trolls in here. These guys obviously can't hide. And we could get the uh, chariots in here as well. Come on. There's one. Oh, right, right. They can't hide either. Um, here's what I'm thinking. There's no reason to hide them. The trolls, I mean, I might keep them back to come in as a flanking support. So let's go ahead and get these guys over here and let's keep the other two over there. But the chariots, I think, are going to uh, ride forth right at the beginning alongside Grom and Tittlemuncha to try and get as much damage done as early as possible. And of course, our archers back over here. Let's get you, buddy, up over here. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. This might uh, this might go a little rougher than expected at first, but let's begin. See what they've got. Or rather, see how they've got it. There's the Reaper Bolt Thor. Already able to fire at us over here. Shift a little bit. They are able to see my goblins. This is a, this is a problem. Pull back over there. Pull you over to the side. That's a serious problem. But we're able to push up this way. Shut down some of these uh, red spears and all. Dangerous? Yes. Worth it? Maybe. This is a little concerning. Alright, we're falling back. These guys are all clumping towards us, of course. Here comes a decent sized cavalry contingent. Come on. Ah, uh, it's not the best hit. I mean, got some work done. Shut this nonsense down. In we go. In we go. Surround that fully. Hey, actually, that was amazing. <laughs> that was actually quite good. Keep pulling you guys back. Let's go. Trying to eliminate this one unit over here. Good job swarming it. Let's pull back. We're about to get bogged down, I think. Get out of there. Get out of there. Nasty skulkers come around back. Let's go. Get out of there, I said. Oh, this is dangerous. This is dangerous. Um, bring our good friend out over here. Let everybody back. Let's go. Get out of here. Let's go. Let's go. Pop that breath attack. Let's go. I say breath attack, but you know which breath attack I mean. Archers are firing over here. Yeah, good stuff. They're engaged over there. Don't keep falling back. Keep falling back. Keep falling back. Let's go. Let's go. These guys are about to roll in. Let's go. Little muncho. Pull through. Pull through. Oh, this isn't good. Who's in trouble here? My wyvern. Oh, no surprise there, I guess. No surprise there, I guess. Keep pulling back. Get some rear charges down over here. I think that's the, that's the answer. Down over here. Keep pulling you through. Come on, let's go. But he's having an okay time. He's having an alright time. He's having an alright time. That wyvern's gonna drop. Which is too bad, but it is what it is. Those guys are in a little bit of trouble. Getting some charges in over there. Keep falling back. Let's go. These guys can push through. I'm a little worried about the Black Guard of Nagarond over there, obviously. But it looks like we have been spotted. Oh god. Dodge that. We took some hurt there. Turn around over here. Good job over here. Let's keep pushing you up. Yes. Archers are still firing away. Push up a little bit. Hopefully we're getting some work done over there. Nasty Skulkers. Good job. Let's pull you away. Stuff your back. Let's get you out of here. We work over here. Let's pull you back. Pull you back. Pull you back. And well over here. Let's pull all of you back. Let's pull. Let's pull you guys back all the way. Archers fall back in line. Right. Let's get into position. Get these guys back as well. Let's go. Archers can fire up over here. Intercept. Got to be careful of the black guard. Obviously. Let's pop that. Uh, 
either down over here. Sold them down right at the end there. No, you're large as well. Let's pull you away. One over there. And you went over there as well. These guys are taken care of. Yeah, archers get ready to fire up there, I think. Pull you in a position. Pull you up, pull you up. Let's go, let's go. Spears, hydras. This is uh, scary, I'm not going to lie. Charge in there. Send you up there. Let's go. Archers fire, please. Oh man, another hit. Go in, let's go in. In you go, buddy. Pop that over there. If we can get there. How are we doing over here? Pull you guys through, get out of there. Archers firing back there. In goes Grom. Stuff, send our spears in up there. Let's go. Get everyone here going there. You go down that way. Pull you guys through over here. Let's go. Pop this, Spirit Leech. Oh no. I have to overcast that. Did a little bit of work there with the, uh... I say a little bit, we did a lot of work there with the, um... With the Purple Sun. And you went over here. An eye out for the Breath Attack. Hydra's in a fair bit of trouble over there. This Carib just is rolling in right now. Pop this over here. Oh no! I saw it happen! I saw it happen! We lost... Not the spiky rollers! No, oh, okay, we still have... I think we still have our OG spiky rollers. Man! That hurts. That hurts. We saw this coming. That hurts so much. God damn. But you know what? All things considered, this army has uh, has survived quite well for the most part, I would say. Thomas Big Wall, try and keep some of these units alive. A bit of shattering going on next. Let's fire up over here. Grom, keep the chase alive. Oh man, that is that is a bummer. I saw it happen. I was just about to pull them away. That's not good enough, obviously. It's never good enough. Now let's see if we can't fire on this Carabdis next, because this one's been taken care of largely. Wish you through over here. Grom, stay alive, buddy. Let's go, let's go. Let's send you in over here. Try and keep that stuff occupied. Push in here for a rear charge. Should take care of that. I mean, again, it's the Black Guard, so we have to be careful there. Grom, let's pull you down over here. Keep these guys engaged. A bit of firing over here. Up Spirit Leech down over here. Let's go. Let's try and focus on uh, Singal there. Singal him out, as it were. We're good, we're good. Yeah, we're done. This battle is done. Let's just make sure we eliminate as much as we can, right? Because again, these guys will come back. I mean, not they'll come back, but they'll... Uh, They'll still be a threat we have to deal with. So let's drop all the uh, monsters. It takes time to recruit them and whatnot. Pop this down on you. Slow you down. Archers, keep pushing through. The nasty skulkers away. Who's this? Let's chase you down as well. Try and eliminate whatever we can, right? Blackguard and Agron are in a decent bit of trouble. Man, I'm still bummed about... Ah, <sighs> It's fine. It's fine. Losses happen. Oh, I did not mean to kill you. <laughs> I want to keep him alive, but it's okay. Where is the Arabdis? There it is. Gotta slow it down. And you up there, Grom, chase that. Pop another Spirit Leech on it. I want to drop that thing. I want to drop that thing for sure. Alright, good. The, the good thing is that, um, Pump Wagon's I feel like we lost our top tier one. We still have the double gold one, which I think is is our best one. But I'm I'm worried that we uh, that we we lost our our best ones, the ones we've had since the first uh, turn. All right, come on, keep giving chase over here so we can pop Mytha as soon as possible. I do want to eliminate this Carabdis. Let's go. Let's go. Between the Spirit Leech, I think the Spirit Leech will probably do the trick, but just in case, we'll slow him down. Or her. Him or her, I'm not sure. Oh, we gotta go so much further. So much further. Come on, Grom. One more good charge, or you know what? There we go. That'll do the trick. For sure. Gotta do the trick. I've put all my eggs in that one ba basket, it, it, it had better do the trick. Come on. Oh, don't you dare survive. Wow, seriously. That Spirit Leech did not do the trick. 
Fair enough. Paying the price for my hubris. Have you been taken care of? Yes, you have. Wow. I got, uh... Shot myself in the foot there. It's okay. That's the battle. Close victory. I'll take it. Hopefully we caused enough damage to it. It was so badly hurt. Okay, no. We lost a regular unit of Snotling Pump Wagon. So it's not the spiky rollers that were with us since the beginning. Like the ones we get, uh, you know, at the start of the campaign. But it is one that's been with us for a very long time. Oh, man. That's too bad. That's too bad. It is a regular pump wagon unit. That is too bad. Well, they can be replaced, obviously. The hole in our hearts can't, but put an F down in the comments to uh, pay your respects, obviously. Go ahead and take the replenishment where we can. And we might need to fall back, actually, because this is a troubling situation. Yeah, we're going to have to fall back against this one. I mean, the, the balance power is only slightly in their favor, but... I need to replenish. Let's fall back. He might chase after me. Let's see. Yep. Alright. Well, hey. That means we got to fight it. Let's do it. Alright. This is going to be a rough one. This is going to be a rough one. Start the deployment. Um, I mean, we could largely hide in the trees. They've got a lot of... Well, not a lot. They've got uh, their artillery capabilities again, right? That we want to try and shut down. Get our skulkers all the way up over here. Ready to push in. We can try and pull the army in the other direction this time, right? Get y'all set up over here. Got to be a bit more careful with our chariots again. That The chariot contingent grows smaller and smaller with each uh, passing minute. Keep our trolls back over there. Actually, let's keep our trolls over here, I think. We can get in with some rear charges, maybe. Get you guys up over here. Uh, the wyvern, I'm probably going to keep back. Honestly, though, at this point, they, like, yeah, we'll keep the wyvern back for some good um, rear charges or maybe to chase down. Well, their chariots are ranged chariots, so we'll get shot at the sky. Oh, man. It's tough. It's gonna be tough. Because, um... They have a lot of range. They have a lot of range. They have a lot of mobile range. I'm gonna have to chase that down for the most part with Mither hoping to slow the enemy down. Um, and with, uh, Foe Seeker hoping to help us close the gap. I mean, we'll see what we can get done, obviously. I think we're pretty much all set up, though. Indeed we are. Again, we're going to try and pull everything onto this side as our Skulkers can push in and shut down their artillery. Let's see if that does the trick. Here goes. Here goes. Got some cavalry on that side. Where is their artillery? There it is. We've been spotted by who? I don't like the range at which uh, units spot in... Uh, in Warhammer 2. Kind of kills the, the pleasure of setting up ambushes and stuff. Alright. Get ready over here. Form these guys. In we go, in we go. Just need some nice clumping action. These guys are basically already taken care of. That's not going to be a problem. Yep, there we go. Melting away. Good stuff. Pop the purple sun. Right down over here. Do it. And y'all up over there. Let's go. Come on, come on. Give me that beautiful hit. Uh, that's not bad. That's not bad. Get our buddy out as well. And he comes. Got this nonsense down. Let's go. Let's go. Chasing after that. Oh, I wasn't the best, but it wasn't terrible either. Oh, no. Get out of there. Get out of there. Oh, these guys are in so much trouble. These guys are in so much trouble. You went okay over here. And you went over here. Not going to catch, are we? We might. I have my doubts. Pull you back. Let's go. Get back over here. These guys keep falling back. Let's go. Let's get out of there. Oh, we're in so much trouble. So much trouble. Get everybody back over here. Moving forward. Let's go. Flee if you have to. Well, there is no fleeing, technically speaking, but you know what I mean. I'm having a good time. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. How are we doing over here? What are you doing over here? Don't need to use my three yet, but I could use this for sure. For these halberds, maybe. Not my cleanest. You guys out of here. Rom over there. Let's go. How are we doing? How are we doing? Pop this. Pop a spirit leech on him. 
Pop this over here. Should scare them off. Trying to get rid of these guys. Yeah, these guys are done for. We might have had a unit get wiped out up there. I didn't catch it. Archers, everybody come up. Let's go, archers. Able to fire over here. Grom's engaged. You need to get out of here. Let's go. No, uh... No wa yet. Oh no, get out of there. Get out of there, get out of there. Go. Oh, these guys are in trouble. These guys are in trouble, get out of there. No! These are the spiky rollers that have been with us since the beginning. Get out of there. Get out of there. And we go try and distract them. All right. Then you up over here. Get you out of here as well. Archers are firing away. Get to it. Send you guys in. Let's go. Let's go. Keep these guys at bay. All right, good stuff. These guys are still giving up. Put you back over here. Let's go. Fire around this way. And you in. Try and get some work done over here. Keep you guys at bay. Grom, how you doing? Doing okay? Doing alright? Oh, you're in trouble as well, buddy. Get you out of here. Pop another spirit leech. Malice is like, does not care. Moving down there. Archers are coming through this way. Let's send the archers up. Fire up there. Or engage up there, rather, I should say. How's it over here? Doing okay, doing okay. Heal up. Move Grom down that way. Let's go. Need to get out of here. Need to get out of here. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Get out of there. Archers, how you doing? You guys all in momentarily? Archers, fire up there. Where are they going? Get you in, buddy. Let's pop you in there. They are anti-large, right? All right, finally we pulled out. And you went over here. Pull you back right away. Oh my god. Alice, buddy. Give up. And you went over here. Let's go. Pop another spirit leech. Into Malice. Get you out of here. I'm taking so much hurt right now. These guys are in so much trouble as well. This is, a uh, Quite possibly... Quite possibly one of the roughest performances I've had. Oh my god, get out of there. Get out of there. It's after these guys. Lose archers back. This guy's out of here. Bring it around, let's go. Swarm a charge over here, I guess. I don't know if that'll do anything. Might break these guys, or it might completely destroy my units. Oh, there's Malice popping his abilities. Keep at it. Keep at it, buddy. These guys are giving up. Okay, good stuff. Archers fire up there. Mom's doing alright. Keeping the chase alive over there. You're coming through. Yeah, let's do it. Oh, these guys are screwed. It's those, it's those chariots, man. Those chariots. This army has been completely wrecked. Oh my god, just destroyed. Just destroyed. Archers, come on, fire up over here. Pull you back, let's go. Pull you in over here. We're in a touch of trouble. Pull you back as well, let's go. And we go for the interception. Malice still surrounded. Alright, good. They've been terrified. Good stuff. Pull you back. We, we need to retreat this army. <laughs> we need to retreat this army. Good shatters up there, so at least there's that. But this fighting cannot continue. I need, I need to pull back. I need to replenish. I need to heal. Pop a spirit leech as well. Ease. 
I had a feeling I was pushing my luck. I didn't realize how much I was pushing it. Managed to keep these spiky rollers alive. Whatever difference that's going to make down the line. Oh, jeez. Alright, how are we doing over here? You're alive, you're alive, you're all good. Yep, yeah, we're all good. We're all good now. We lost some goblins, I'm almost certain. I think that's, that malice is all that's left. Hold down, he goes? Yeah. My lord. Heroic victory? Yeah, I'd say. How many did we lose? These goblins. Oh, these poor goblins. Did we lose these nasty skulkers or did they make it out? Did we lose them? Did they make it out? That's... And there's a sliver of hope there as well, but no, they've been wiped out. Almost certainly they've been wiped out. My heart. Look at the damage we did, though. We did quite well. Oh, damn. Did we not lose a single unit there? We did not lose a single unit there. That is ridiculous. All right, fair enough. Heroic victory indeed. I will take whatever replenishment I can. But we need to fall back. Right back to the Tower of the Stars. They're obviously going to pull back and replenish. Recruiting another army. Oh, my God. Lightning striking can only do so much. All right. Oh my God. How many? How many? How many Bretonians are there? How many? How many Bretonians are there? In a rebellion at the coast of Araby. Okay. Fair enough. I guess the raiding is doing that trick. It's enemies killed in battle. Confident defender. <laughs> Good sea captain. Well done, Grom. Okay. This is uh. Oh man. We were in hot water before, we're in hot water now. Let's go ahead and pull right back, yes, to the Tower of the Stars. We will replenish. Cool. One turn, two turns of replenishment will do the trick. No. This is unpleasant. No. Foolish request. Let's get stabby. This is unpleasant. Let's get Failed a 63% success. Come on, man. I need you to be on your A-game. Now, I'll take these guys a couple of turns to recruit some of their... Ow. Oh. They seriously all survive? Are you kidding me? I was going to say, take some, it'll take some time for them to recruit their uh, scarier units. That's problematic. Alright. We're fine. We're fine. Uh, we could get... I don't really want the armored squig hoppers. Not for, uh, not for this army. I want to get those spiky rollers back. Well. We had pump wagons, but I'm replacing them with, uh, with spiky rollers. Picking up the pieces of that one unit and mashing it with pieces of other units. Building us some more spiky rollers. It'll take one turn... I don't know if I'm feeling comfortable enough to push after one turn of replenishment. Maybe. You know what? We might be fine because we don't want them to recruit too much. We don't want them to recruit too much. But remember, it is two turns of movement on our end. We'll see. We'll see what they end up as. I think it's wild that the AI doesn't send both of those armies out at the same time. If they did, we'd have been destroyed. We would have been crushed. But hey, they get to do whatever they want to do. They can do whatever they want to do. All right, okay, so hold on. Oh, one more on a sense skill point. That's Grom over here. One more of the big lads. Makes sense to me. Um. Yeah, everything else is fine. Yeah, sure. Good. Cool. And Tittlemunch, I assume. Yes. She did well. She almost died in that last battle. Um, But we took care of her in the end. Honestly, Doom and Darkness... Is sounding pretty hand handy right now. Just the terror bombing, right? Like, not a bad call. Not a bad call. Or I can give her devastating charge. Or even just one more step of fervor. You know what? Yeah, one more step of fervor. Let's do it. Because we've been using the purple sun so much. Oh my god. They leveled up a lot. Two battles, I guess, right? Um. Well, let's go ahead and give her Soothsaying, sure, help the leadership aura. Uh, the reason why Doom and Darkness I'm hesitant about is because we're like almost always able to use the Purple Sun. Spirit Leech, we're almost always using. Fate of Buna, less often, but we should probably be using that more often. So adding another spell into the mix is probably pointless. You know, we're, we're pretty well set up. Now, up over here, this is uh, problematic. Did not expect two more armies to come rolling through. And how... Oh my god. This is going to be painful to deal with is what it's going to be. Alright, this army over here. Lots of archers. Mostly men at arms. Some spearmen at arms. Probably use either of these armies. 
Uh, we could send Thograt in, right range fire right from the start. Dabigan as well, firing away right from the start. I think we can take him on 1v1 and be fine. Do you take me for a churl? Let's check. Yeah, we, oh, we can actually auto-resolve this. Do I feel comfortable doing that? That's the question. You know what? I'm going to fight this myself, I think, only because... And the AI in Warhammer isn't as bad as it once was, where it would um, it would really obliterate your army with the auto-resolve. Yeah, you know what? Fine, let's auto-resolve this. But watch, as I say that, as I say that, this army's going to get obliterated. Oh, yeah, see, that's, that's not so good. Not terrible, but I probably could have done better than that. Our artillery only having 20 kills apiece, that tells you everything, right? But fine, we'll eat the captives, get the replenishment. I guess we can pull you back up to here and get uh, both of these armies together, right? Sure. A regular march will get you up to there. Oh, you can only get up to there. Alright, sure, fine. Let's move you first. Regular march. Let's see if I pop you in a coffer. Helps only marginally. Fine, let's get you up to here. That's a problem. That's a problem. Well, actually, you know what? This is a pretty easy army to take on, I think. And they're in a force march stance. So I can hit them. These guys will be able to hit me afterwards, but they will... Possibly, if they force march, they'll be able to get the support of that other army as well. So fine, here's what we'll do. We'll go ahead and move this army in to strike at Iraq... Or oh, sorry, at uh, Sir John Tireweld. No, what the... F That's infuriating. That's infuriating. Wow. Wow. Wow, one of the worst misclicks in the history of misclicks. That could cost us a lot. That could cost us a lot. Nothing we can do about it. Alright. Okay. We're in trouble. We're in trouble. I cannot believe that happened. I cannot believe that happened. Oh my god. Just the slightest twitch of the hand. Oh my god. Alright, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We'll be okay. We'll be okay. It's not the end of the world. Not the end of the world. Uh, Grom, you're fine. One turn recruitment. Money we'll hold on to. What's happening down over here? I just ignored this guy, right? Move you up. Hurry it up. Alright, cool. Skip to settlement upgrades. Imminent rebellion, of course, the coast of Araby. Yeah, well. Something or the other is going to take this. Oh, we're in trouble. I cannot believe that happened. It's okay. We good. We got this. We got this, we got this, we got this. Go for the little fall. Okay, it's okay. Decisive defeat, no surprise there. Fine. It's fine. Cities we can always get back. Oh my god. A golden opportunity to take that army out. And a misclick is what gets me. A misclick. I cannot believe it. Low obedience over here as well. And we got some serious problems going on, right? What do we have here? Bel Aliad. Alright, well, we've got the army right over here, so let the let the rebellion pop. Let them rebel. Um, move up to here. Still, no, not gonna pop now. That's too bad. That's why I was hesitant about moving the army into the space, but at the same time, I don't want to fall back, right? We have to be a little aggressive over here. Uh, okay, okay, we're fine. This army, uh, will be annoying to deal with, but we can deal with it. Of course, we've lost Kofor, hence the lack of replenishment. Could fall back and 
misclicking all over the place right now. Could fall back and take care of these guys. I make landfall. I'd arrive over here. I mean, who knows? These guys, they might go into the water. Don't think I can strike them. My concern is, what if both armies pile up on me? So, sweet Bert, we shall strike. Oh, he's gonna fall back, of course, he's a coward. Well, we can keep pushing through. We need to fight this one. Because that's, that's nowhere near enough in our in our favor. My god. Alright, well, hey, to the battlefield we go with this one. We need to, <laughs> need to minimize our losses here. Can't believe we lost Bofer. Well, hey, it's fine. It's a city. Cities cities get recaptured all the time. The battlefield we go. All right, Let's see what we can do. I feel like it's when you you know when you're when you're prepping. A, oh, that's not quite so helpful, but we'll, we'll we'll make it work. You know when you're prepping a meal and you're like yeah you, you see it in movies every 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 so often movies or cartoons or whatever like you're pouring the salt in right you know just like salt to taste. You just want to put like a tiny little pinch in, but uh, but the top of the salt container falls off and. And the, the whole salt just kind of piles in. Yeah, that's that's what that was like. Within a moment. <laughs> within a moment, it was all gone. All right, uh, this front line is very flimsy. Now, it's not like they have a very strong, you know, front line either, but their archers are a serious concern. Their archers are a serious concern. Let's get set up over here. We need to make sure we stay on top of our game, right? Get you guys over there. Our artillery. These guys need to be firing as soon as possible. And we have the big gun able to, um, well, he's able to fire right from the start, but he's also able to defend if things get too close to the trebs. Uh, we could also get the Arab boys. You know what I haven't checked in a while? My cooking. I just realized I haven't checked my cooking in a while. And that might be a problem. Get the cavalry over to that side. They're pretty weak as well. The warlords boys. Let's pop you over to this side. Get you guys over here. Alright. I mean, let's see what we can do. The Trebs, are you able to hit right from the start? I think so. Yeah, it looks like they are. Alright, cool. So we'll focus on their archers. We need to melt all that nonsense away. Um, hold the front line. Dive in from the sides and, and rears again. Because their their front lines are not particularly impressive. There's just a large number. Uh, it's the archers that scare me more, I think. So we'll, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. Let's begin. Let's begin. No magic or anything this time around to help us either. Man. Enforcements have arrived. We'll see how much uh, they actually help. In come the shots. Gotta get me some good hits here. Let's make up for our earlier mistakes. Alright. Okay. Not terrible. Didn't seem to do a lot of work to the actual unit I was aiming at, but hey, whatever. I'll take it. Oh, come on. <laughs> that was terrible. In come more shots. There we go. Good hits there. Enforcements. Start pulling you right away. They've got a long way to go. They've got a long way to go. A couple more shots coming through. There we go. Change our focus. Different unit. Again, if we miss a little bit, there's a big clump there that we can strike at. Let's pull these guys a little bit more to the side so they can charge into the peasant bow. Come on. In come these shots. Yeah, good hits, good hits, good hits. A little bit of lateral damage action, as you can see. Oh, man. Come on. I have this kind of missing. This is a problem. How uh, heavily leading they are to that side. Get it pulling back. Let's get a couple good volleys in there, please. Archers ready to fire. Almost. And you up there. Artillery. Are over here. The nasty skulkers coming in from the side. And you guys off to the side as well. Archers are firing way over here. Pull you back. And you win. Let's go. Hopefully, we're okay in that engagement. This, I'm not super comfortable with. Push. Push. Let's push. Oh, we're not doing very hot there. Go. Archers are firing away. In comes our cavalry as well. Artillery is in maybe a bit of trouble. Let's dive you in there. Send you in as well, buddy. Let's go. Fire up there. Air is kicking in. Rear charge is kicking in. Good stuff. Sending these guys back. Hopefully packing. Fire over there. We're holding the line over here, sort of. Come through over here. 
Alright, good hits up there. These guys keeping their distance, I guess. In comes our reinforcements. Alright, good stuff, good stuff. Good stuff. Dive in, buddy, dive in. Pull you back. I said dive in. Listen to my orders. And eat a rear charge there. Not the end of the world. Fire up over here. You guys are scared off. In comes the reinforcements, as I was saying. Send you guys through. Let's go. Send you guys through. Pull you back over here. Their leadership is right over there, so that's a bit of a problem. But looks like we're still okay. These guys are getting scared off. Yes, excellent. We're coming through over here. Good stuff. Chase. Wa Active. The uh, Goblin Rock Lobber is back over here in a touch of trouble, but I think that'll be done soon. Come on. Get there. Let's go. Yeah, we're okay. Pushing over here. You guys are pretty badly hurt already. And you up there. Archer's firing up there as well. How's it over here? Still need to chase? Yeah, a little bit. Just peasants. They're just peasants. They're just peasants. Good work over here. Let's turn around and fire up over there. Or not fire, but uh, chase up over there. Get you firing over here. I guess you can keep firing over there. Buddy. Well, there's the win. We want to hurt them some more, is the question. Wouldn't be a terrible idea. Wouldn't be a terrible idea. They weren't in Force March, if I recall correctly. Alright, so we might as well. We took a lot of hurt. Here and there. Took a decent bit of hurt. Yeah, one more volley over here. Sounds good to me. Whittle them down. Good stuff. Chase over here. Chase over here. Let's go. Oh, that was a good hit. Those men at arms took a bad hit there. Good stuff. Keep pushing through. And we're not going to catch these guys. We're not going to catch these guys. At least those men at arms, maybe. Archer's done a good job. We've got these peasant bowmen fully surrounded. Let's get these guys chasing after the peasant bowmen. Let's speed it up. Don't need it all to happen so slowly. Chase after those spearmen at arms. Yeah, we're good. We're good. Finish these guys off. As much as we can. Okay. I guess that's the battle. I think that's all the work we can do. These primitive arms are probably going to keep their distance and get away. We might catch up to them a little bit, but not enough to make a big difference. So let's let them be, I guess. Sure. Decisive victory. I will take it. My god. No units lost or anything. A little bit of damage done. Basically wiped the army out. Still a couple of units that probably survived there more than I would have liked, but... Their range contingent completely eliminated there. Just obliterated, I should say. 269 kills here. 105, 101. See, that's the kind of killing I want to see out of my catapults. Now, these guys obviously got caught out, but it's not the end of the world. Go ahead and take the replenishment here. 8%, sure. Okay, good. Down goes the army. Maybe... It, I thought it was... Hmm. Can't remember. But you know what? Doesn't matter, because the army has been eliminated. This is the next one to deal with. What I could do is I could force march, get out over here, and then get the uh, two-pronged attack approach going. Get rid of Killian. That would allow us to pull back with full force, take Kofor back, and then uh, chase after whatever they have whatever they have left. God, what a setback. What a setback. Now, La Chique, I I don't feel like I should invest over here. Because these guys, if they keep pushing, they will get there before I do. Oh, that's so unfortunate. You know what? I might actually... Attack with just Thograt Neck Snapper over here against this army because it's a smallish army. Again, weak troops. We can eliminate it pretty easily, I think. Whereas Arachnic will pull back full sail or full speed um, to hold John Tireweld in place. Because if we if we force up to over here, we'll block the uh, the escape, and I doubt he'll abandon Kofor and pull, push towards Lashik. That's probably what we have to do. While Oglock over here waits for the rebellion to pop, I suppose. A little unfortunate. Oh, you know what we could do? There. Force the Rebellion. Oh, wow, seriously? Even raiding isn't gonna... Fine. 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 Um... Damn. Little, uh... Smallest, smallest, littlest bit of mistake. Cost us. Damn. We're, uh, we're... As for coffer, we're, we're coughing on our French bread, eh? Uh, it's okay. Alright, we're fine. We're fine. Over here... This is going to be interesting as well. I could strike against one of their characters. I could try at least. See how it goes. Right, buddy? Right, buddy? Come on. Good. 
a high note to end the session on. Folks, this is where we're going to call it. Still in precarious spots on in both wars. I'm shocked at how this one went in a good way. I'm surprised we were able to keep things alive for as long as we did. Uh, but we did. One more turn of replenishment, I suppose, is in order. Allows them to recruit a little bit too much. And maybe I don't take the replenishment. I think we should push. I think we should push. And then we've already discussed what's happening at Kofor and Bretonia. Or, you know, pseudo Bretonia. Folks, I hope you enjoyed this session. Yeah, see, we've been without a dish. Like a fool. Anyways, we'll, we'll get one cooked up right at the start of the next session. But folks, I hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, you know what to do. Let me know by leaving a like and a comment down below. Oh man, rough start to, to the week of sessions. I ah, oh, We'll be fine. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. As always, a massive thanks goes out to all of my channel members and patrons for supporting the channel on a monthly basis to keep us alive and running smoothly. And a big old thanks goes out to each and every one of you for watching. Until next time. Cheers.